Welcome to TLB TV Overtime. I'm Joe Malandricolo standing next to Austin Klepper at Bob Turtle Smith Stadium here in College Park, where the Terps used back to back home runs to walk it off against the Penn State Nittany Lions. Let's take a look at the highlights. Brian Schaefer took the bump for the Terps, making his ninth start of the season. We pick it up in the top of the fifth, where Ryan Sloniger smacks a solo shot to give Penn State a 1 0 lead. Schaefer would settle down after that and finish with 11 strikeouts. We're talking about consistent players and you got talking about Schaefer. And it's just, you know, your Friday night starter kind of is like the face of your program. He's really just been a mark of consistency for us. A strike him out throw in that double play ended the top half of the ninth, leaving the Terps just three outs to work with. It was time for the rally caps. Zach Jankarski finally broke through with a clutch homer to tie things at one. Maryland's second hit of the ball game. And on the very next pitch, Brandon Gum sent the ballpark into a frenzy with a walk-off bomb. The Terps mob at home plate, celebrating a 2-1 victory. Now, Austin, the two big home runs in the ninth, obviously is going to be what everybody's talking about. But Brian Schaefer pitched an absolute gem to keep the Terps in this game. Talk a little bit about what he did tonight. Yeah, Brian Schaefer was tremendous. He went 8.1 innings, only allowed four hits, and struck out a career-high 11. He is the reason they won, because he was able to keep them in the game when they were cold, because Penn State's pitcher was lights out tonight. He was just not letting anything happen. Before those two home runs, they only had one hit. So Schaefer is a huge reason why they were able to come out with the victory today. The Terps will be back in action at 2 p.m. tomorrow. For TLB TV, I'm Joe Malandricolo, and that's Austin Clever.